I'm looking out my window, I need a billion. A whole lot of whips, money in the ceiling. I was unable to secure a PS5 or Xbox Series X pre-order, but it's all good because I'm in the PC Master Race anyway. Enough about that, we back. We back, bro. Yes. Yo, what's good? This is Chill. Back with another first listen. This time, it's the homie, Larry June and Harry Frog with the project called Keep Going. I'm super geeked to hear this, man. I haven't heard anything about it. I know it did come out the beginning of last month. Somehow it missed me. I figure now's a better time than any. 10 tracks, 25 minutes, perfect for June. 25 minutes, I mean, you gotta make it hit. To be honest, when I first got tuned into June, I was not a huge fan. It was on this uh, Cardo project and what he was doing on there was just, it just was not rocking for me. But as I kept checking for him, I was like, I kind of fuck with this dude. He's grown to become in my normal rotation, man. But Harry Fraud, fire producer, man. I love his production. He's been around for a while. I think he's out of the East Coast somewhere. But hey, enough talking. Let's go ahead and get to it. Once again, this is Larry June and Harry Fraud with Keep Going. Let's get it. All right, let's go ahead and get this project started. Coming in at track number one, we got Keep Going intro. All right, keep going, my name. Yeah. You know. Keep going. Shit get tricky sometimes. You know what I'm saying? Fresh orange juice and shit with the pulp and shit, you know what I mean? Beating ass, real player shit, you know what I mean? Yeah. So don't check me, bitch. Check your motherfucking bank statement, you know what I mean? Cause we eating over here. Alright, so that was track number one. Keep going intro. Pretty much standard June, man. Just warming up for the intro of the project. Kind of setting the mood for it. Letting you know what you're going to be in for. I got some 70s, 80s funky feel from that, man. It was only a minute, so you can't really say much. That being said, let's go ahead and get to the next one. Alright, coming in at track number two, we got Organic Miracles. There you go. I know God protected me, but I still keep that. Mm. I never keep the where I sleep at. Numbers. Take it to the top. For real. Hustle don't stop. Yeah. I own my masters, baby. It's no way that I can flop. Thanks. I put my heart in the game. It gave me everything I needed. Numbers. Let's go, June. I Bruh. This is fire so far. Like I, I like the way June sets the tone for his tracks. You know exactly what you're gonna get from a man. Vibe wise, he hits that shit out the park. And I like the way he's doing this, man. It's not too much. I feel the only thing missing is the drop, bro. Y'all know me, I'm a sucker for hard 808s, bass drums and shit. That's that's what gets me in a drop. Harry, he has a signature style. He does not do that a ton. My bad, I get excited. Let's go ahead and get back to it. Lately I've been thinking. Sure. Had yeah. to pinch myself yeah. twice, I still feel like I'm dreaming. I'm still mm. sleeping with this Nina. Yeah. I'm on my yeah. way to the top, yeah. I just hope you don't change on me. All right, so that was track number two, Organic Miracles. Dope track to me, and like I said, I love the way he harmonizes. He never really does too much, it's just enough to add that sauce on it, and he just swags it out, man. I'm here for it. Harry Fraud, mm, you one of them guys, man. I fuck with it, the vibes you set. Like, the shit you did for Currency, I was there all the way. I wish I could remember the name of the project, but hey, I'm here for this. I love riding, chilling, like cruising music. That being said, let's go ahead and get to the next track. All right, coming in at track number three, we got Sunday Morning Drive featuring Currency and Dom Kennedy. And hey, bitch, don't check me. Check that motherfucker back too, you know what I'm saying? No. Mm. Man, I swear this beat so smooth, I can sing to it. If you really at it for real, then it's your theme music. Fuck a middle man, I land in the A and hit shine. Now a nigga Rolls Royce rise. Rolls go watch, black face, kind of style. Hey, June doing his thing, man. But to be quite honest, I'm intrigued to hear what currency do to this. Dom, I'm somewhere in the middle. My man then gave me a couple suspect features, and I wasn't really okay with that. So it's like, currency, I know what I'm going to get. Dom, please. Please give me some heat, bro. You can actually rap, man. I'm a fan of yours. So it's like, bring me some heat. Let's go ahead and get back to it. Third the silver serving tray. She had the duck. I had the slice of cheesecake. Yeah. Pellegrino so number nine yeah. for the chase. My reputation, my presentation is first class. You so pressed with that Southwest boarding pass. I'm stretched out on the beach. All I ever wanted was an AMG. Mm. I did everything except for make a beat. Uh -huh. Clico still spilling. Still on the come up. Every 
time to sun up. Yeah. I'm not on the hype, I'm thinking cash. Thinking cash. My boss and my word is all I have. All right, so that was track number three, Sunday Morning Drive featuring Currency and Dom Kennedy. Pretty dope track. They didn't leave Earth or nothing like that, but everybody did what they were supposed to do in that track, man. Everybody came through with their own vibes. Dom Kennedy, thank you for giving me a dope verse. Currency, I always know what you're gonna give me, so it's like no stress on you and June. June doing his thing, man. He ain't doing too much. It's perfect for me, man. Let's go ahead and get to the next track. All right, coming in at track number four, we got I Like You. I was dipping down the block, my tires were shining. Glanced at my rear view, pretty girls behind me. I stopped by the stove, had to grab me some condoms. I'm keeping it pee, cause it's all I know. Had to triple up my pockets and big up my goals. I used to have a girl. I really wanna fuck with you. Girl, let's get this paid. Alright, man, I gotta be honest. This is the June I don't like right here, man. Because I get it's a little, it's the same kind of vibe we've been rocking with for these four tracks up to this point. But he seems to kind of mail it in sometimes man on other tracks he brings some extra sauce to it june june has so much potential and just sometimes he does not get there for me but this this june i'm not really a fan of man that's why i like when the projects are short and to the point let's get back to it don't yeah. play games with me if you ready to show me you the badass bitch and i know that you know it but i'm the flies nigga walking so if that bitch cat off then i keep shit moving booming Everything's for sale. And if I say I'm go do it, bitch, then I will. Yeah. All right, so that was track number four, I Like You. Um, To be honest, I didn't really dig that track. It didn't do much for me. When I come back to this project, that song is definitely getting skipped over. It just doesn't do anything, anything at all for me, man. Nothing swaggy, nothing saucy, no extra shit. The harmonizing wasn't even that dope. I'm like, and I fuck with Jim, but sometimes my man, it just, it just misses. Like always, let me know what you thought. Let's go ahead and get to the next one. All right, coming in at track number five, we got Orange Juice in Vancouver featuring Jay Worthy. I had to bust a move in Santa Clara, so she came with me. Shit get tricky, got 200, I can turn lick. Private valet, had to gas up the Grand Nash to go and bend the block. Lost my wallet, hopping out the 50, but like, fuck it, dog. See, Larry, that's my brother, fuck this rap shit. Oh, Cause we was doing doubles on our trap shit. Mm. Trips to Vegas, knock a hose in Lil Tokyo. Underground forever, but I'm next to blow. Lexus on, I don't do the least, maybe you should know. You should know that. Had a Pull up to the Beverly and then she told all right, so that was track number five, Orange Juice in Vancouver featuring Jay Worthy. Pretty dope track. I definitely thought Larry June's rapping in that was a little bit more tight. He had it more together. He wasn't just floating all over the place. If I got to be completely honest with myself, Jay Worthy, man, he kind of took that for me. I like the way he was rapping, even though it sounds like he's holding in smoke the whole time he's rapping. It was still dope. My man was on that. You can tell. I think he's out of Cali, if I'm not mistaken. He kind of had that Cali swag throughout that whole thing, just laid back, but I'm still gonna get to it pretty dope track man let's go ahead and get to the next track all right coming in at track number six we got expensive couches don't check me little nigga check your hygiene 2015 trips to the philippines when i touched my first million dollars didn't announce that i be going be small living life so comfortable and i ain't gotta talk my numbers just know i mean i parked the grand nash by the bend run it up gotta make it happen i ain't gotta sell dreams but you know what's happening okay. when she see that mad Benz, then she know it's daddy and everything gucci on my end you know what i'm saying cold aesthetic and shit Satisfied. All right, so that was track number six, Expensive Couches. It was an all right track, man. Nothing really to complain about. Like I said, I'm hoping they was going to leave Earth, but one thing I had to come to terms with is Harry Fry's production mixed with Larry June they may be a little bit too similar and what i mean by that is larry june is extremely laid back harry fraud his production is extremely laid back so you get two of that and it's kind of like they too chill it's like kind of like when people get too high they just be way too out of there so they're just comfortable doing their thing hey not all projects can hit and be that shit that you're looking for man this is why they do it it's only 10 songs so hey let's go ahead and get to the next one all right coming in at track number seven we got let's go to new orleans featuring currency I don't listen to the politics, I'm living better now. Giving inspiration to the streets to get that cheddar now. Gotta push myself to go hard, keep mashing. Go for a mold, nigga, don't pet it. Never take no for an answer. To live like this, you gon' have to take ill. You got the blues, you feel the blues. I've been through it. 
weekend with you through the music Instead of listening to motherfuckers, you know I ain't never do shit My mind already made, the world closed down My niggas is still getting paid, that's God's great That black one ain't for me, that's my homeboy Ray Alright, so that was track number 7, let's go to New Orleans featuring Currency Pretty dope track. June came through with his normal style. You know what I'm saying? Didn't really do too much. I don't feel he rose to the track. Currency came through, did his thing. I feel his rapping is a bit more substance, if that's the right word. Or he gave you a little bit more energy, gave you a little bit more complexity within his rap. So it's like, it kind of worked better for Currency. I'm just being honest. Like always, let me know what you guys think about it in the comments. Let's go ahead and get to the next track. All right, coming in at track number eight, we got Drinks with Tracy. First one, I woke up and I thank God. Cause every time I reach in my pocket, it's a knot. Every time I walk into my shop, then I made a turn on the side. She lived in the mall, so I jumped in my nash. What's happening? You looking hella nice today. But I'm a man with a plan, I got goals and shit. I rock white tees at my shows and shit. Rolex Diamonds, life's amazing. All right, so that was track number eight, Drinks with Tracy. Yeah, it was an all right track, man. More of what this project has done for me, it's not giving me much, man. I've listened to damn near all of June's projects by this point, except for his newest one. I've heard pretty much all of the old ones, and he has stuff like this where this project will have a lot of slammers on it. The next one may get one or two. I haven't really got much from it, but this ain't it, Chief. Gotta be honest. Let's go ahead and get to the next track. All right, coming in at track number nine, we got a talk with Herm featuring Herm Lewis. I'm looking out my window, I need a billion. Mm. A whole lot of whips, money in the ceiling. Beast mode, nigga, I'ma get it. June. Where was this at the rest of the project, bro? I'm not saying he just went in right there, but the way he crept on the track, that's why I come to June, bro. That smooth ass production with June just walking on that bitch. He ain't running, he ain't fucking rushing, none of that, man. He just walking on that track, super soft style. Please give me some heat, cause I've been needing it the whole project, please. Let's get it. Took out the grab the rice and beans. Nice. Crab enchiladas oh, and the sauce green. That player shit. 300 ain't shit to a real pig. Fuck a pandemic, we need more digits. You was on the couch, we was trying to get it. TFM nigga, pay attention. I'm not going to brag, but this beat is definitely kick ass. That Moosey got the hairy frog. All right, so that was track number nine, a talk with Herm featuring Herm Lewis. Fire. That's the energy I've been waiting for, that player shit, man. June, that smooth beat mixed with that player shit do you bro sometimes i feel june be giving half efforts man might be needing a little bit more and that was it i kind of wish herm was out the way please believe i fuck with herm i like the shit he be talking but that was a dope track man i liked it shame it came toward the end i was hoping we were gonna get a lot more of that but hey let's go ahead and get to this last track all right we finally made it to the last track on the project this is track number 10 let me sing to you that music got the hairy whatever you want man Alright, so that was the last track on the project. Track number 10, Let Me Sing To You. Dope track, bro. But it wasn't even really a full track. He basically hooked out that whole entire thing, bro. He could have hooked that out and just made it an instrumental and gave people the opt to flow on it, man. June, you bogus as hell. That beat was knocking. The way you was doing that, it was a play off the whatever you need. You know what I'm saying? That song. Girl, you know I can provide that song. It was perfect. I just needed some verses and we didn't get it, bro. Come on. Uh, and it was so close so so close but hey i fuck with it It was pretty dope as far as the project as a whole it was d so and that's just being completely honest man i really only had a couple standouts on this project we got track number three sunday morning drive track number five orange juice in vancouver track number nine a talk with Herm, and then this last one let me sing to you i mean those are really only ones i'm gonna come back to this project man i gotta be honest i'm disappointed man i really couldn't even if I'm gonna introduce somebody to Larry June, this is not gonna be the project to do it with, man. I'm more of a fan of June with Cardo. It's perfect. Like their their styles mesh, but you get.
get enough knock with Cardo with that smooth laid back play of shit with Larry June. Harry Fraud and June, I said it earlier in the first listen, they're a little bit too similar. Harry Fraud super laid back, Larry June super laid back. Just a sleepy project in my opinion, man. At least it was only 10 tracks, 25 minutes. But hey, let me know what you guys thought about the project in the comments. Let me know if you got any other things you would like me to first listen to. I know I got a couple requests. I'm going to go ahead and get around to them when I can. Please like, subscribe, share. We greatly appreciate that. Feel free to join the Discord. We're going to be doing a lot of things in there. You can give me ideas for first listens or for other video series that you may want me to do. We can chop it up, have rap debates. Me and the homies been doing that a lot lately. Feel free to promote yourself in there. I'm not saying if you're an artist, flood us, but come through and promote if you're a producer. Float around some beats. Maybe I'll play some of your beats there in the backdrops of these first listens or some of my other videos. Videos. Just come through, fuck with us, man. No script. And like always, chill out. No script.